I do believe the very nature of mission and being about a mission has to do, first of all, with feeling possibility. You feel the potential of what could be present in your own life and in the world in which you live. And you have some kind of powerful felt sense, powerful intuition about what could be the pregnancy of what could be born in your own life and in your world. And it gets to a point where you can taste it. It gets real for you. You believe it. You have faith in it. And it's important enough for you that you're going to do something about it. You're going to live it. And that's the second part of what it means to be fulfilling mission. Because to fulfill mission, it's not enough just to dream the dream or feel the possibility. You have to take an affirmative step in the here and now to do something about it, to make it real. You have to care about it enough and see the possibility enough, believe in the possibility of it enough to do something here and now, to let it live. For people who are on a mission, what I've noticed is that they have the humility to humble themselves to that first step, to the, the small thing that needs to be done in the moment. They have the humility to see that the structure of, the, of their own physical form and the physical forms of their life are important. The structure of how they get along with other people is important. The earth of the thing matters. And the things of heaven, you might say, the things of potentiality, the things that are of essence and possibility, that are in the mind and the heart of the creator that we are, those things become real and they have the opportunity to manifest because they're manifesting in our own earth, the earth of our physical bodies, the, the guiding principles of this new culture are with us all. It's the wisdom and the integrity that goes with that wisdom to see the structure and the pattern of what we're sharing together. And so to engage with it creatively, to make our contribution to it, to take responsibility for our own experience in it, not to be projecting all over each other, oh, you didn't make me happy, you didn't do the thing that I wanted you to do, and therefore I'm feeling bad. No, I take responsibility for what I'm experiencing and what I'm feeling. And I have a affirmative responsibility to give my gift, to give the creative thing that I have to contribute into this system. I'm proud of this place, Sunrise Ranch, in that to whatever degree we have over the decades, we who have lived here have for real looked at these things. You don't get to have a ranch and a conference and retreat center, and you don't get to have a thriving community because you're simply passionate about a great mission, but in the living of your life, you're not looking at the integrity of what it means to be together fulfilling it. So we have, we say, a learn, learning and demonstration site. First of all, we're learning. <laughs> we who live here, right? That's how the, that's a learning and demonstration, or we say it's teaching and demonstration site. Well, we're teaching what we're learning. So it's a learning and demonstrating and then a teaching. It's a, it's a deep learning. And we have to engage ourselves in that deep learning. 